If you haven't learned the name Devon Thibodeau, you will for sure hear it this season. I'm Elijah Nixon, your St. Landry Parish reporter, and Thibodeau is an outstanding linebacker for the Raiders, and he solidified his name last year, and he hopes that this year he can build off of that success. I want to max my potential out, you feel me? You know, I just really, I just want to be the best person I could be. Last season, David Thibodeau showed he could be a superstar on the Raiders. The All-Metro Defensive MVP and District MVP finished the year with 69 tackles, 17 were for loss, and he also had 10 sacks and two forced fumbles. Friday night is when people could see him perform at his peak, but the work is done months before the season. We got two more. We need to add five or ten. You can't even lose. It started in the summer, you know, staying after practice. So that had really been on my mind. But I wasn't thinking to go that far, though. <laughs> Thibodeau will be a four-year starter this upcoming season. The linebacker's success didn't come overnight. In the earlier parts of his career, he struggled. Uh, film, it was on my butt, bro. I kept messing up. I was a freshman, you know, so I didn't really know no better. And it was frustrating because I wanted to be that guy. And becoming that guy takes a lot of work. Thibodeau is usually the first one in and the last one out of the weight room. But for him to really tackle his goals, he needed to learn from those that came before him. Some of the guys we had old, old McKenzie all doing, you know, we had Colin Guidry on um, that place where Western Kentucky comes down every offseason work with him, a defensive end. So he started seeing guys getting out of here and seeing what it takes, and I'm glad the older guys come back and uh, show him what it takes. As of now, Thibodeau doesn't have any college offers, but that doesn't stop him from chasing his dream of getting a college degree. Going to college and graduating and just living a happy life. But if, we, if the NFL happened, it happened, but going to college and get a free scholarship, that would be like my number one goal. Now Thibodeau's success was known throughout the state last year and this year he hopes to have the same exact success but it won't mean nothing if he doesn't bring home a title to Northwest. Reporting in Opelousas, I'm Elijah Nixon, your St. Landry Parish reporter with KATC TV3.